everybody, Kelsey here at TerraWise Solutions. Today I'm here with Johnny Roberts. Today Johnny is going to explain some of the features of the LIGA blk to go So Johnny, how does the blk to go collect data? So the blk to go is a handheld scanner with LiDAR technology, sending out pulses of lights and collecting 3D data from that. It also has SLAM inside, which is taking that data and in real time creating a 3D environment. Anything you walk by, anything you see, you're going to have that. Okay. What kind of jobs would you use the BLK to go on? Uh, I would use it on a lot of different jobs, actually. It's really good for ALTA surveys, uh, augmenting drone data, tree surveys, um, any single family residential, that type of stuff. Okay. What are some examples of jobs you might have used it on or customer? Uh, we've used it on a bank. We've used it at a rock quarry. Uh, we've also done a eight to 10 acre outlet site with a lot of parking spaces and a lot of buildings. Okay, awesome. Do you mind showing me today some how to get it going? Absolutely. So you're gonna wanna take your phone app. and I, I assume you've downloaded the free app already. Uh -huh. So you can either touch this button here to get it initialized or there's a button on the app as well. Either one's gonna work for you. And once you touch the button, this is going to be blinking yellow, letting you know this initialized and the slam and the LiDAR are getting fired up. As soon as that turns green, you're ready to start scanning. Okay. There we go. So you're going to pick it up and face it away from you. You've got cameras on all three sides. You've got 270 degree field here and a 360 degree field up. So it's actually getting things above you as well. Okay. So if you just want to walk and you're collecting 400,000 points per second, which is an enormous amount of data. Um, and you're going to come to ground control points. As long as you've got good ground control points, you can take all this point cloud data and move it to your real data on site. You're going to want to point it down at the nail. Give it 10, 15, 20 seconds, a couple times on different sides of the nail. And by pushing this button here, we're going to take a picture of the nail. So one little tap on that button is going to give us a picture on our screen. And we'll see that we've got a picture okay. of that nail. That's a color and we're going to use that later to move our point cloud data. Uh, to the control point. So as you're walking, you can see that you're grabbing the curb, the building, anything that's 75 mm -hmm. feet or less from you, you're going to be getting extreme amounts of data on. And that's going to allow you to pull out your top of curb, your bottom of curb, your gutter lines, um, and create great topo mapping from one side to the other. And I know in a lot of cases, a lot of surveys, you need center line of road, and sometimes those roads are busy. And you really don't want your crews having to get out in the middle of the road, putting up signs. So this allows you to stand on one side of the road and collect the road data just by standing there and looking across. So it's super safe for your guys to be able to get the center line of any road. All right, if I need to get the center line of this road, instead of having to go out there and collect data along that center line, I can simply take my scanner, point it at the area I want to make sure I get. And I've got good information now on this side of the asphalt, the other side of the curb, as well as the center line, without having to play Frogger and dodging a lot of cars. So now we're going to head back to our starting point. And yes, we've already scanned this area, but as most people will tell you, you can't really have too many shots or too much location. So we're going to come back. It's going to be scanning this area again. So we're really getting two scans of this area. And that's really going to densify our point cloud and make it pretty easy once we move it to control of pulling out those feature lines and topo information for our client. Oh. Science is very lightweight too. Doesn't weigh very much. <laughs> <laughs> and fortunately the scans don't take very long so you're not really holding it for a long time either. Uh, but you can imagine this area here may have taken 45 minutes to an hour, typical surveying, even with GPS. And we were able to do it in uh, just under three minutes. So uh, really a time saver and you can get an enormous amount of data in a very short amount of time. So I'm going to put it back on our puck there, hold down the button till this starts blinking yellow and that will end our scan. So as far as time saving, convenience and safety, this is really the way to go and it's kind of the future of how surveying is going to be done, especially field surveying. So uh, give me a call if you want a free demonstration, 404-859-3309 or reach out to us at terrawisesolutions.com. Thank you. Thank you.